Did you have anybody come and visit the studio? Um, I know that obviously you befriended Elton John. Great taste in music, obviously, Elton John, as we know. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, but you know, did he, did he sort of come in and did you play him stuff as you were going on? Or anybody else, any of your mates? I mean, did you keep the door open for people to observe or did you keep it quite closed? Uh, we, had some, we had some visitors. Mm -hmm. Not too many. Yeah. My dad Elton came. By. Of course, that's what I was looking for. <laughs> <laughs> Elton didn't come. Well, he stayed. He was staying guess. across the street. Right. So literally. Yeah. And uh, yeah. He came. He uh, wouldn't stop talking about you. Came down to the copy of Brace Cop. Was like, guys, you're going all down the wrong direction here. This is what you need to be listening to. Check it out. We had to just, you know, let's listen to this. <laughs> so we played him our stuff. He was like, yeah, well, you know, you can but hope. Um, the name Sam's Town of the record. Uh, you know, obviously it's a casino, and we've established from the, the articles that it's something. Thanks, Ronnie. I love that. It's uh, established that it's, it's somewhere that you you lived opposite for a while. But yeah. it also sums up the overall kind of vibe of the record, which is that you have immersed yourself in America's heartland. And you have committed yourself to, you know, your observation of where you live this time. Yeah. Yeah. Safe to say. When did that idea come into your head? When did you start thinking about putting a record out like that? <coughs> when we were, you know, we'd be call, you know, people will talk about how English we were, and there's still, there's still people that think we're English, mm. and uh, and it's not an offense to us. It's just once we came over here, we realized how little we knew about what was going on here and mm. what people are like and what it's like. But what we do know, what it was like, you know, where we grew up, and what it, you know, what our parents are like, and and I think we kind of embrace that on this album, and mm. and it's it fe it's just feels right. Mm. Well, you definitely the lyrics that you sing on the record, there's conviction to us. It feel like you're painting a false image. You know what I mean? Like you know, you, it, it, it's tough to touch on that imagery as well when so many greats have. I'm not just talking about the influences people are throwing around right now, like Bruce Springsteen, Jim Morrison, but great country and western singers and great mm -hmm. blues singers have mm -hmm. touched on America. And you know, you really got to, I think, have seen it. Otherwise, yeah. it can come across pretty fake. Okay, hang on.